So the biggest disputed issues that I see when reviewing a construction contract are going to be the indemnity provision, the flow through provisions, and then contingent payment clauses. They, these are the kinds of provisions that I see most often affecting the parties' relationships in an unintended way when it comes time for litigation. Um, so an example would be with a contingent payment clause, it has to be worded just right to be enforceable. A subcontractor who has not had his contract reviewed generally can't imagine that the general contractor for whom they work isn't obligated to pay them. But if, draft, if drafted properly, that's exactly what can happen. From the general contractor's perspective, they certainly don't want to become obligated to pay the owner's bills, and so they put those provisions in there, but it's very easy to make a mistake, and that entire provision is unenforceable. Thank you.